Unlike any other bride, Katie has never tried on a single wedding dress. She feels left out, so Hayley takes her to a bespoke wedding shop. But she has to stick to the rules. She can only try and not buy. Okay, so if you come to the mirror, uh, this is a bespoke dress by the designer called Sharon Bowen. Um, I'm not sure how you feel about the colour. God, I'm gorgeous! <laughs> <laughs> we have to remember though, I'm not buying a dress, and Sam is. Well, you know. How's, how's he gonna. No, it doesn't even bear thinking about it. <laughs> Can't even buy his own clothes, can you really? <gasps> it's gorgeous. <laughs> that is your romantic garden dress. That one is your evening big gown. Wow. I need to be spoilt on my wedding day. It's my one and only wedding day. And if anybody accuses me of being spoilt, <laughs> why can't I go get spoilt on their wedding day? I haven't seen it yet, so and the other shoes feel feel free to pick it up and let's stand on there, please stand on. I feel very exposed. That top bit's really pretty. There's a lot, a lot, a lot of skirt and there's a lot of my shoulders and fat bits. It's not necessarily what you would have picked. But has he done a really bad job? Try something over your shoulders. Yeah. And see what we can I do. I can't look at myself that. at the moment because of that. Well, let's put something on your shoulders and see what we can do. Okay. Yeah? I can't look at myself in it. Well, let's put a, put a wrap on and see what's, what we can do. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. Right, there's, there's, a, there's a few things that, that, that we can do. Okay. Did. For Majita, the most important dress of her life has no price tag. Oh dear, um, my tissue box is upstairs. <laughs> oh, you look gorgeous. But Majita's only allowed to try, not buy. It's what Jip thinks that matters. <laughs> it's a traditional girl in there somewhere. Yes, obviously. deep down. <laughs> yeah, <exactly. laughs> the dress is a big deal. I hate to sort of sound kind of vain, but at the end of the day, this is my day and I, I want to look gorgeous. If he doesn't get me a dress that I look nice in, then I'm, I'm going to be disappointed. Medusa's far more traditional than she realises she is. Jip's definitely got his work cut out, because I, I think what he'll think she likes is maybe not what she likes at all. Seeing myself in those very long, full dresses, I thought, well, this is actually what a wedding dress should probably look like, and I felt more like a bride in those. Yeah. Yeah. I just can't take full, full breaths. <laughs> Would you like to have a look? Okay, Jess, do you want to have a look? Is that a look of despair <laughs> or pleasure? <laughs> right, Maggie. Yes, this is the Cinderella moment. Oh. Um, Lift this foot. Are these ones I weren't wearing? Yeah. Are these my wedding shoes? Yeah. Oh, wow. Get comfy, dear. Yeah. <laughs> I think you look absolutely beautiful. Oh. Is that you? <laughs> You're not grabbing anybody else. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, I'm not going to be able to control myself now. Ready? Steady. Oh. Do you like it? Oh, I love it. It's just, <laughs> it's so amazing. Thank you. Oh, thank you so that much. That fits well. He's done an amazing job. I can't believe it. I don't think I really expected anything like this. I wasn't expecting pattern or... You won't speak. <laughs> It doesn't do anything for your waist at all. I'm sorry. She said it doesn't fit here at all. It doesn't, it doesn't fit because it's too low and it doesn't do anything for you at all. <laughs> I think that Lee's going to struggle with finding a dress 
because they're all very different sizes. So I think he's really going to struggle with that and I'm not a stereotypical size so he's not going to be able to just go to a shop and pick one off the shelf and know that it's going to fit. Look Sophie, look in the mirror and tell me that you want this. I just feel like if you choose something like that, I'm really going to feel really self-conscious the whole day. And obviously I'll wear it, but what he thinks it will look like will be so much worse than actually what it will look like on me. Mm. Oh my god! Oh my god! Amazing. Do you like? Oh my god, I love it. See now that's beautiful. That is beautiful, Serene. Do you know something? To me, that just how I imagine it. How do you feel in that one? Besides the fact that it's a bit big. I don't like the brooch. Will dress two fare any better? Oh, Serene, that's beautiful. You absolutely look stunning in that dress. Still wouldn't want it, really. See, that's grindy to me. Well, I don't like a veil, and I don't quite like any type of veil. Right, just piecing that on my head. Okay. I could come here and pick you a dress with all the bits you want and the bits you don't want. Well, I'm just like thinking, it's not even me that's got to do it, it's Andrew. Reminds me of Vianetta, if that makes any sense. Vianetta what? ice cream. What? You look like an ice cream. Yeah, I'm sure. I'm walking these shoes. <laughs> oh, wow. That's lovely. It's a bit big. <laughs> but, um... It's a gorgeous dress. Yeah, this is lovely. I love this dress. I like the back of it as well, actually. It's What's really pretty. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like we've got a hunchback in this, but... <laughs> you get the idea. Yeah. How do you feel in it? Honestly, if I turned up on my wedding day and I had this, I would be so, so happy. Absolutely loved it. It was beautiful. It was my dream dress. Off you yeah. go. <laughs> oh, wow. What do you think? What do you think? I don't know. I'm, it's not what I was expecting. Do you want to see the tray? Yeah. Yeah, turn it round. Okay. Let me let go of it a minute. I just want to see this. Are you disappointed then? Not exactly, but. Um, but. I don't know. So I'm just, yeah, I'm just not sure. You're just not used to it? No.